Today we will be testing various sealants to see which one works best to seal your diamond dot paintings. We have also decided to compare two designs. So here we have our darker whale design um, and we want to see if the sealants work better on this compared to the lighter design like this one here with the yellows. Firstly what we are going to do is take just a normal brush, you could even use a toothbrush or any kind of brush for this, and just get rid of any dust or any snacks or any dog hair, anything that's gotten stuck between the beads. going to do is just take some normal masking tape to place down over certain areas of the design. The only reason why we are doing this is so that we can see what it looks like with and without. start with gloss Mod Podge. Okay, so I'm going to take just a normal brush like this and take quite a bit actually. just normal Mod Podge so I think because we're going to use quite a bit we can just sort of plop it on there like that and then start to spread nicely Zenith spray. So we're going to give it a good, good shake and then hold it just a little bit above and just spray. going to try this guy. These are all found at Builders Warehouse. So give it a shake. The 
craft do. So we are going to just design which is the whale in this area here this is the normal Mod Podge this is the gloss Mod Podge this is the spray mate spray paint and this here is the zenith and don't forget that this area over here is our control where we place the masking tape um, what I really love is that the Mod Podge worked really nicely and didn't leak as much as the spray paint um, so obviously because we did a cross section the leaking was a little bit more of a problem but when you are doing the whole design it won't really be such a problem um, but comparing the two Mod Podges I would have to say they're quite on par with one another the gloss obviously definitely I think this one this one over here definitely has a little bit more of a shimmer but the plain Mod Podge worked just as well um, which I really liked. Then the spray paints also kept such a nice shimmer. Obviously you are going to lose some of it as you can see in comparison to the middle here. But I have to say I'm very impressed. Both spray paints worked really nicely. Um, we only did two coats um, and I think it turned out really well. What I do want to comment on is how all the sealants added a little bit of a stiffness to the design um, which then prevents bees from falling off so it won't be as flexible um, which is awesome all of them worked really well the Mod Podge definitely has more of a stiffness than the spray paint um, but I think they all work just as effectively so it's really up to you which method you would like to use as they all worked really nicely and let's now do our um, lighter colors so this side here is normal Mod Podge this here is the gloss this here is the spray mate and there is the zenith and we have our cross section with the control just like the previous one this also still kept its shimmer quite nicely. It's a little bit harder to see with the lighter designs. Again, I think the gloss definitely has an upper hand, the gloss Mod Podge. Um, but they both kind of had the same effect. Losing quite a bit, actually, if you can see in the control how much of the shine has gone just in that little corner over there. Um, so the lighter colors might not have worked as nicely as the darker colors. Still there, the shimmer is definitely still there, but definitely not as prominent. If we look at the bottom at the spray paint, similar situation, quite a bit of the shimmer. This area here is the control. Definitely a difference in terms of the shimmer. We have lost some but I think it is still there. The same stiffness, which is really nice, so your beads won't fall off. Um, but I think with the lighter colors go with Mod Podge, I think the, the shimmer is definitely a little bit better there than it is with the spray paint. And then finally, we did the craft glue here. Okay, so we have the control in a bigger area here and here. We only glued this area over here. Again, a very nice stiffness, so it can't bend as easily and you won't lose beads. And it kept a really nice shimmer, actually. Quite impressed with it. It obviously is not as good as Mod Podge, 
um, in my opinion. But I think that shimmer is, is really good. Um, here's the control. If you look at the belly, there's a normal shimmer. And the corner here is where we put some glue. So there's definitely a dulling. But the shimmer is still quite nice. And yeah, that is it for our sealants. So I think definitely the top performer is the gloss Mod Podge. But I think they all actually came out really nicely. And I would probably use any one of those products um, to seal my diamond dot painting.